Hello guys, this is Vignesh editor. So in this video, I'm going to show how I did this pick into this rim light effects. Let's get started. Before that, if you're new to this channel, please subscribe for more future updates. Let's start. So first, we shall create new layer with a height height of 3000 and width 2400. It depends on your picture. Let's create it. And then cut out your image, whichever you need. Then I add it into our new layer. Which we created and and create a solid of a darkish color wherever the dark is we can do it like glowing effect so i choose bluish dark then create another solid f solid layer which is white the light coming from behind invert the mask control i so it can in invert then paint from wherever you need the light i painted it from behind me from top of behind me you can paint wherever you need after that i put behind it behind my subject after that Let's uh, create another duplicate so it can look brighter. I chose a uh, white color for that. I need a little bluish. Okay, this is better. Then I made some retouch on my image. If you know this tutorial particularly, please let me know in comment section. After making it touch, uh, this is the time for rim light. Yeah, this is. Let's create a brightness and contrast adjustment layer. Make it brighter as much as possible, and it's bend blending mode into luminosity, so it can affect lights. Paint in the edges edge of your subject. In my case, to rotate like this, you can click on R. It's a shortcut for rotation. Now I'm going to paint it. You can paint, and you can play with that uh, opacity flow, so it will easy to you. And I will make it fast. After that, I created another exposure adjustment layer, make it dark as possible, not for everything, you, you can make it as, you, as your image requires, for me it's little dark. You have to invert it mask and paint it on the opposite of lights, light source. In my case, it's light coming from top, so I paint it at bottom. Mm, light is coming from up, so I'm painting it on my hair.
play with the flow flow and opacity of the brush you you will get it as soon as after that i created one more exposure layer with the highest and it's blending mode to luminosity play play with it in the edge of the your object yes like this light should be in dark as bright as dark make some feather touch like this so it will look real realistic see the before and after okay you can change the brush brush color as uh, x short uh, shortcut play with the flow of the brush this is the main secret of using the brush for rim light after that i created one more solid layer and painted lightly slightly on the edge of the shirt my shirt double tap on the layer and drag that slider for the dark areas to the right hold alt and drag it okay after that i create i'm going to create another solid layer for the glow effect which is bouncing from my shirt you can put it behind and paint slightly as possible you can feel the glow right like this you can play with it after this i'm going to apply my camera raw magic filter <laughs> 